Well, well, hello there. How's how's everybody doing today? You doing good? Good? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's get to it. So, this is pretty much the staple class: Scavenger Pro, Stopping Power Pro, Ninja Pro, etc., etc. And I'm using a FAMAS with a red dot. If you haven't already fucking noticed that already. Oh shit! There goes my phone. I wonder if you can feel the vibration through the microphone. And it's Christian. He wants to go to lunch. And I'm going to say no because my mouth hurts. Eh, maybe, maybe later. Alright, so I'm not really saying much right now because I die right off the bat for one death. And yeah, that's my only death. But there we go. I try to be a cool guy, throw a throwing knife, but he just comes around the corner and I pop him in the face. So I come back up here. I like this spot because it provides a good view. It's not like 360 degrees, but it's a good view of just posting up around this area, which is what we're going to do for a while because they just start coming in and it's just really easy to just pick them off. They're not really, they're not, they're just playing really, really, very, very stupid. They're playing very stupidly. Is that, is that the correct English? I don't know. I drop back because they all start sniping me, so I don't want to get popped eventually. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Oh. So yeah, if you if if you're watching this commentary to look for like total like leet uh chopper gunner skills, you you've come to the wrong place, my friend. That you are not you will not find that here. You'll you'll see what I mean in about two to three minutes. That guy's that guy's raging. Right now, I I'm not raging. I'm 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 doing like amazing. Oh. This guy in that bunker. You see, like if I stayed in that bunker, that guy would have, that guy would have freaking destroyed me. But I didn't. So move around some more. Move around some more. Don't know where they come in. They're kind of pushing over on that other bunker side. I think so. That's why I kind of move away from that side. My team's kind of got that down to a science. Oh. Let's see, I got... Move up here. Pop that guy. VMA tells me there's a guy in the cockpit, so I go up and pop him again. Well, in all seriousness, I should just calling him, start calling him Jason. Because if if he hasn't figured it out already, that was me that called him the other day at Pudge Brothers. That's right, motherfucker. Do something. <laughs> All right. So my Harrier starts doing work. I'm just chilling because I don't know anybody is. I love that. Rewarding people Ow. Doing real shitty. <laughs> and now now he's complaining. Now he's complaining about death streaks. Although I'm not, I'm not really a fan of him either. I don't know anybody who is. It's like, oh, here you're doing so terrible. Let's let's give you an incentive to do worse. It's just it just makes no sense. As I said before, if you're looking if you're looking for amazing chopper gunner skills right here, well, it's not really my fault. It's not like it's it's not like it's my skills are terrible. It's just they're all sitting in the fucking cave. So I get one, two. Three, and that is the only kill. Those are the only kills I get. So you know, don't don't be looking for anything else. Where are they? And now is where it starts getting kind of interesting. I mean, I mean it doesn't get tremendously interesting, but I start moving all the way around the map because eventually they're just gonna pull out my dual ranges and totally fail. VMA just told me he's raging, and Echo 4 is like, yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love listening to VMA rage. It's like the, it's probably one of the greatest things. And right here, I pretty much almost die, and I'm almost cry. I don't really cry. But I'm not really that far into the nuke yet, but... <laughs> I feel like I feel like 
Uh, and this is where I start moving around. Now, the reason I start moving around is, you, is I should probably start talking about the gameplay. Is because when you see on the, if you see looking at the UAV, you can see them all start moving from the from the cave towards the cliff. So I'm starting to move clockwise around the map because I don't want to get caught up, and I want to start spreading around more. And then VMA drops out right here, which really made me a sad panda because. I was talking, I was like, yeah, I'm going to get, I didn't get like anything from my, from my chopper gun, I'm totally going to get this nuke. I totally didn't think I was going to, but I did anyway. Nah, that guy drops a javelin. Bam! Don't know where they are. Don't know where they are. And everybody is raging. There's a guy right here, and I don't know where he is. I was like looking for him, then he was behind me, which was amazing. Like, pop, 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 pop. The FAMAS is so like the most amazing gun in this game. If you haven't, if you haven't used it, it's better than the M16. Everybody's like, oh, the M16 is more powerful. Yeah, except the FAMAS can like snipe across to like 20 miles of whatever it's amazing now this is actually a bad move on my part because the cave is just it's just like a you'll just get cluster fucked so I think I pop one guy yeah I pop one guy and get out of there pretty quick now I don't know where my team is spawning so I drop back to see if I can get somebody now they're all just spawning back here, so I cautiously, I cautiously, very cautiously, move up this side over here because I want to get a better, I want to get a better vantage point because that that cave in that back over there is not a good vantage point at all. Like I said, you'll get cluster fucked. That guy's yelling cocksucker. I think they're all very frustrated that they're we're not really doing anything. Oh, look at that. There's a guy on top of the cliff. Pop! <laughs> oh, I can't wait to go skiing tomorrow with Flint. It's going to be great. He's up on that little fucking cliff up there, dude. And that Echo 4 that guy is like, you, is like yelling that there's a guy up on the cliff, so I don't really know where I'm going. But I, th I eventually go over there, and there's, there's no one there. So I think he may have dropped down. So I come around here, think there's someone here. There's not. Move over. We got three kills left. Now I want you guys to notice how well the movement around the map was. Like four minutes ago, I was over at that fucking bunker, and it's just it's just really nice to that I eventually counterclockwise moved all the or clockwise moved all the way around the map. It's kind of hard to do sometimes without getting killed. Because you don't know where the hell they're going to spawn. And this is pretty much where I just start laying down the law for about five seconds. <laughs> they're all thinking, oh man, this guy's going to get a nuke. Better watch out. Bam! And then I get blamed. That's pretty much it. I mean, I just want you to oh, no, to watch, man. and then Echo 4 is like, holy shit, he got, like, nothing, and he still got it. But anyway, yeah, just, just, if you're going to move around the map, if you want to get a nuke, and you don't want to get a, and you don't get, like, any help from your chopper gunner, you got to move, you got to watch where your team is. You got to move with them. Otherwise, you got to watch where the other team is, and you got to watch where you are. Otherwise, if you're going to stay in the same spot, you're going to get killed eventually, so it's not a good idea. But anyways, yeah, and there's Tommy Franks telling me, holy shit, you just got a nuke. And that's it. Peace out. Oh, go watch my uh, my skiing movies and 